Oh well, this is a real fast, action packed <laughs> landscape photography, blood pumping through your veins. This is feisty, rushing, getting out when it should have been really easy, taking my time, chasing, running around like a madman. Landscape photography slowed down. My ass. <laughs> well, not today anyway. It's a real big tide for Formby. It's very stormy. So let me explain. I set off. I set off this morning early to go to the Lake District and everywhere was flooded. The M6 in places was so dodgy, really dodgy. So I came back home, did a newsletter, an email newsletter, which if you follow me, you will have received with all the exciting news that's gonna take place. <laughs> and get my arse in gear, which I'm sure will happen. I'm very excited about the prospect of a new year. And I've loads of videos from here, but I don't think you can have too many by the coast. Look at that light. If you're a content creator, video producer, or you're just looking for music and SFX for your next project, use the link in the description and my offer code MALLY10 to get yourself a 10% discount. Thank you to Audio for supporting my channel. So why am I here, you may ask? It's 35 minutes from my house and I saw that the sun had somehow managed to break out and I, I thought, yeah, come on. I can't be locked up today. We've got to get something. We've got to go out. We've got to see what's happening. And I don't think we're going to get a sunset. We're about half an hour off it. I haven't took a shot yet. <laughs> but it's looking wonderful. It's really cold and fresh. The clouds are magnificent. I think I might stop here and just take a couple of shots. The lines in the sand look fabulous. Yeah, let's stop here, let's get a shot. Thank you so much to Freewell Filters for sending me a set of the variable magnetic NDs. I've been testing them out for over the past four months and using them on all these videos you've seen. Most of the images taken have been taken with either the polarizer or the ND at various stops. If you're interested in more information about these filters, head over to my website. There will be a blog post this week full of details and information all about this filter system. like glass and reflections just beautiful absolutely beautiful it really is like a big sheet of glass all right i'm gonna push out into the water and see if i can get this plane of, of mirror like sand a bit more, uh, I, how can I explain it? A bit more with the sea and a bit more with the reflections. I really like this shot. Come on, I'll have to take you with me. Excuse the backwards hat. I'm not getting all hip hop on your asses. Just <laughs> doing what I need to do. I hope you're enjoying this as much as me. It's wild, proper wild. And. Uh, it's trying it's best to kick off with colour. I quite like this shot actually. 
loads of reflections and the clouds are just incredible. We've got the inlet, just a little small piece of land coming in that's feeding in a dirt shape. Minimalist is out, I tell you. It's just oh, so tranquil, but yet furious sounds of the sea. I think this could be the end of the light and the colour. It's been snuffed out over Anglesey and Wales with these huge plumes of rain clouds. So it's a short one. I hope you've enjoyed it. <laughs> oh, look at the colour on the sand. Right, we're going to push off. Let's keep going. I've not a clue if you can hear me. <laughs> Look at this. It's like one big mirror now where the tide's uh, finally going out. Slow, very slow here at Formby. But it leaves this wet sand untouched. Beautiful. So I'm going to finish up here. I'm getting some real deep, long, minimalist reflections and the clouds just, ah, oh, plumes, beautiful, huge. I'm so glad I rushed out for this, especially now we've got this flat mirror surface. Sticking the horizon right in the centre, breaking the rules, because when it's in the centre with reflections like this, it just looks great. You can choose in post after if you want to reel the thirds or you want to play around with the composition or the actual uh, aspect ratio. But for now, I'm just loving the simplicity of the, in the middle, the reflections and all this movement going on around me. I'm sorry, I'm not talking in the lens because I've actually got the tripod for this, running a time lapse. <sighs> Excited. Just a bit, as always. How could you not be excited with this? I'm carrying on. The sunset was 10 minutes ago and it's throwing this, just a luminance of light over the top of the bank of clouds on the horizon. So I'm going to keep shooting. But for you guys, I'm going to call it the end because I'm frabs, I am freezing. Proper hands, can't feel my hands. Um, there's bits of colour appearing now on the edges of these clouds. And the reflection's getting better. The more the sea goes out, oh. There's nothing at Formby, nothing. Don't come to Formby, there's nothing here. I've heard people say, it's just flat. There's no rocks, there's no cliffs, there's no interest. The interest is the sky, is the sea, is the sand. The interest is what you make of it. Seriously, you've done it again for me. For a minimalist, spiritualist, for a minimalist and very spiritual, simple, easy, relaxed style of, of getting images. I say, I'm saying that, I've been running around like an headless chicken, but you know what I'm saying, look at this. Can you see how that just... We don't need big rocks. We don't need all kinds of details in the land when you've got this going on. I love minimalist photography, and I really do need to set some projects and do some more of it. I'm going on again, aren't I? Thanks so much for watching. Great experience to just get out when you can. Join me on my podcast and stay tuned on YouTube for more videos to come. This year is a big year. I'm going to make sure of it. You never know what's around the corner. So come along with me. So if you've liked this, hit subscribe and if you want to see more hit the notification bell and well there's only one thing left to say and that's see there.